Hey everybody, so today we got the call, we got the tip off that um, the new 2020 XDS RR has arrived that was part of this deal with uh, the XMR coming involved. So it came in, came in a little sooner than, than we planned, which is a good thing because I'd love to get my hands on it right away. So. Our 18 XRS here what we're going to be doing is removing a whole bunch of the aftermarket stuff and uh, carrying it over to the XDS because quite a bit of it actually jumps over there so going to be taking out um, the SB filter and the, the stereo system you know and uh, what else back there them whip mount try to take off some bumpers or whatever we'll, we'll see what we can and what, what's not worth it we'll leave on front bumper system and the winch will rip out and the LED light so we'll keep the windshield in that I've got the original bumper up up there and all the rest of the regular air filter system to pop back on there and then from that point we're stuck with the the option and we have the chance to take off all these plastic panels and and swap them with the new one but I love the new color scheme on the new XDS with the um, that dark dark gray and uh, mantic green it's a pretty wicked setup so as much as I love these graphics maybe it's time for something fresh and new but I also love these so I'm gonna start dismantling for now the aftermarket stuff first and once we get down to the plastics and the graphics we'll see what that's gonna entail to get things done that way if not we got some extra graphics there to cover up without my name on it and um, the new buyer has a pretty wicked uh, protected machine so we'll get started gonna clear out some room get the XRS kind of brought out over here out in the middle start de-assembling stay tuned we've got more to come and uh it's only a couple days away here so we'll have a fresh 2020 xds ready to roll and uh we'll be picking that up maybe even race them against each other real quick for a totally not proper break-in but what's one race stay tuned yeah go for it Okay, so just a little update on the progress. Uh, cut the visors off, the windshield, get the roof off, side mirrors. Mm, where else? And we're getting to this here. Get to the front speakers. We're starting on the stereo now. We got um, back here. We took off the the, the 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 whip mount, and now we're just getting this speaker loosened off. So we had to do that to get the whip mount wire off. We ported them down the back 
down into here. So what we're gonna do now is we took this little side piece off. So what I'm doing is I'm putting certain little parts in a little baggie or something with, with screws. So we come back and I got all the screws for everything and certain small parts, you know, we're putting in there. Um, and then little things like this. So just cause there's so many screws that are gonna happen here. So I'm just kind of feeding them back in a little bit. So they're, they're ready for when we get back to them. Then we're not looking all over the place and dropping them everywhere so i'm just going to follow these lines now and more or less see uh where the the rooting of those go down well so right now we're just tracing the the wires back up the speakers you just go up there just cut a few zap straps everything else is just stock wiring it's pretty pretty simple setup so we're just gonna get this speaker wire back to where it meets the other guys and it's probably gonna go up inside there. So we'll find out where that is and then we'll get up front to the to the head unit and go from there. There we go. Pull off the top there. It's a tight fit, so basically you got this guy really, really, really it's super tight on here zero that goes down there like you're lucky if you ever get film there's some leaves and stuff and junk around the outside but other than that pretty darn clean we're gonna take this off take all this off and uh, then we can get to the wiring as well probably gonna do all the wiring because all the wiring goes down in the middle and through the console tunnel up there so well some stuff just stops back there by the batteries and all that stuff but everything going forward goes up through the tunnel there and then we'll put the original plastics all back on here get this back to stock pretty soon this will be almost exactly as as bought new other than maybe a couple accessories we won't get off and Graphics are still up in the air, so we'll see how much that entails to you to get all that off. They do say on the website it's easier with two people for uh, putting this guy on, and I 100% agree. But we don't have that tonight, so clumsy. Clumsy stuff instead will happen. Take the brackets off, put all the screws back in so we know where they all go when we get back. Alright, and there's the, uh, the original we pulled off when we first bought the machine and got the uh, SMB going, so it's back to stock. Got uh, speakers hanging here, wires are all disassembled. And I know we got the electronics behind the seats and we're gonna have to uh, probably pull that tunnel open. I would definitely assume we're gonna have to do that to get to uh, get the head unit all out of there. So once we have that out, we also will, and this is all exposed over here. That's the point where we'll get to the good old winch area so that's gonna have some wiring going back there too so we'll try to hit back from the front while everything's open pull the speakers down and uh, that's almost dead actually we're it's moving along quite well uh, so we'll get this bumper off the winch and we'll get the rear bumper off and pretty much from that point all the aftermarket stuff will be off uh, except for these guards on the sides I'll look into that later and see see what's gonna happen with those or if it's worth taking off or might be a whole bunch of rivets underneath to deal with we'll see um, I'm not even sure I'm gonna put that style back on an XDS um, right now they work pretty good for the XRS here but 
on the XDS. Everything's narrow or so. It'll probably still work good, but just not sure if I want that look or if I, maybe I want something a little more smoother, tighter in. If we can get away with that, we will see. So let's keep plugging at her and yes, we're getting somewhere.